I put my glasses situation over here just because I wanted it hidden for a while. I feel like it's been exposed and so I have them here now. And I could see which ones I'm going to wear. How cute are these? I definitely have to clean this mirror, it's so bad. Oops. Okay, let's go. Target now. We already went to Marshalls and they still haven't brought the holiday stuff out. I don't know what they're waiting for. I got this really cute vase from Marshalls. I'll show it to you guys in a second. But I'm looking for some stems to put into them. Oh, I got this one. This is so cute. Ooh, ouch. This is nice too. Oh, look, I ordered some of these. I ordered like one or two of them. Say hi for the vlog. <laughs> Just wait. You look like a sir. That's what the sirs do. <laughs> Pine and eucalyptus garland. Oh my god, I had a garland. <gasps> Maybe I should switch it up this year. Because I had a garland. Baby, you remember what garland I had last year? Whoa, what is this? Bottle brush tree countdown calendar. Oh my god, should I get a wood star? <gasps> I should. I already got a Christmas topper, I think, the other day. Look. Too bad gold is not my color anymore. I'm more into the natural tones. El gold como que ya no me ministra. No me habla. El gold. Babe, there's more. There's more this way. Come on, let's go this way. This way, this way. I think that's the only reason why I would want to upgrade to the iPhone 13 for like the cinematic thing when you're filming. Hey, look at these. They're so cute. We are in the Christmas section. And it's almost wiped out. <gasps> yes, I think I'm going to do these. How cute. I can add these to like the coffee bar or something. These are the, the vibes that we're going with this year. We're doing a neutral Christmas. So all of the neutral decor is what I'm getting. Wait, okay, this is the ornament that I got. <laughs> Look, this is our tree topper. I got this one, cause I didn't want to do like a traditional star. I don't know, I kind of want to grab some of these, but I don't know where I would 
put them and what would i do with it okay but why is this the cutest thing you've ever seen in your entire life because it's definitely the cutest thing i've ever seen stop look how adorable i really was not planning on doing any ornaments on the tree today but maybe we can do like limited one how much is this one ornament three dollars this one is three dollars not two shabs okay but like is this tacky or is this cute what do we think because i think it's kind of cute imagine they get 200 dollars. that's the price tag for it this is actually adorable and i'll actually like display this on something get cute should i do gold i really didn't want to do ornaments guys like i didn't want to do no ornaments i'm not feeling it maybe just like little special ones but i really wasn't feeling like ornaments this year no sé por qué look at all of the other stuff i don't know what else to get nothing is calling my attention of this one for the background of the vid and i'm also gonna get two of these these are nice the little mini ones and then these are the, the mini ones and the big ones this is cute we can layer them somewhere this is so cute it lights up we're back home now bags i just gave the boys the toys <laughs> and they're going crazy mia you look adorable papa lindo hi lindo look at him <laughs> where's my mama you toy me toy you gotta give it to me papa so i get it already go get it whoa milo's legs are out of his pjs already <laughs> <laughs> the PJs are from Target, by the way. They were only 10 bucks, and they're so stinking cute. <laughs> but Milo's... <laughs> Papa, let me fix it for you. Look, his legs are out. <laughs> they don't shred all this paper. I don't know where they get it from. I want to do like a little haul for you guys to show you what I got. But I kind of want to save all like the Christmas stuff for Vlogmas. This from Target. I wanted to put it over here. This was my vision to put it here. I have to paint this over, but I wanted to have it like this. So this was the vision for this little situation over here. So here I can put some avocados and then here I can put something else. But that was the vision. Cute, right? This is Christmas stuff. This is also Christmas decor that I got from Marshalls look how cute i got them a three set of holiday toys the christmas toys mama come give me yours yay baba you guys gotta get walked okay we're gonna go outside we're gonna go outside give me that give me give me give me neo stop it and then look how cute these are guys adorable three dollars i got two of them i want to put them in the bathroom hey mia you have your own toys papa I want to put, come, give me the toy. Give me, Papa, give me. Give me. Then I'm not going to play with you because you're not giving it to me. Here, Mia. Go get it. I know you got to give it to me, Papa. Come. First of all, y'all stepping all on the Hawaiian bread. I have to do so much cleaning today, but I really don't feel like doing any cleaning whatsoever. Mamai, he wants me to pull it, but he doesn't want to give it to me. Come. Give me. <laughs> Gimme! 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 Me! Savage. <laughs> Y'all are savages. You guys, I'm having a little bit of creativities, difficulties, is that if that's even a word? But I wasn't in the holiday spirit until today. Went to Target like I showed you guys and there was just an explosion of Christmas everywhere. And I picked up a few little things like I showed you guys and you guys saw in the vlog and I didn't want to put up my Christmas tree until like around Vlogmas for like Vlogmas content. But I kind of want to put up the tree today just so that I know the placement of it and then little by little I can go rearranging and like moving stuff. The only thing is that this year is going to be different because we have a dining table. I got this dining table in January and so last year we had the holidays without a dining table. I also added the coffee station which is right over here. So we really don't have space for a Christmas tree this year in the living room unless I like completely change things around and I kind of want to see if I can make it work I feel like my living room still looks very summery because we have this like 
huge green plant here which I love and I really don't want to get rid of. I redid the living room this year after Christmas so there's so many new pieces and I feel like everything looks perfect the way it is like everything literally looks nice spot everything has a spot and so now trying to make space for, for a Christmas tree in this room is very difficult for me right now and I have an idea of where it can go but it's gonna require me to move things so I guess I'll just show you guys my vision so right now my living room is a hot mess don't mind it we just got back and I kind of just threw things everywhere but this is the dining table and I didn't have this last year also didn't have this last year either didn't have this last year either last year I really wasn't into decor like that not as much as 2021 for sure so lots of things have changed in a course of a year so what i'm thinking of hear me out this is a vision and again i wanted to wait for vlogmas to do this but because i got so many christmas stuff i'm kind of like in the mood again i am not going crazy with christmas this year last year i wanted to do this like winter wonderland situation i even like hung up shelves in the wall and i did like a whole shebang i ain't doing that this year definitely not so i think this is the only space that the christmas tree is going to fit in this is the one that i bought the tree collar absolutely stunning like are you kidding me if this doesn't scream me then i don't know what does so i'm so excited to see it put together but obviously that would require me to move this shelf my idea is to put this mirror over on this side because i was already like over this kind of decor i don't even think it goes well like look this is not even hung up properly it just fell so get rid of of this right move this on this side so it's going to allow light because we do have the windows over on this side and stuff so i think that's going to look good only thing is this right here i don't know if i can put it also like transfer it to this side as well i don't know another option is to just put the shelf on this wall over here i would have to get rid of the doggies pen for a little bit and find somewhere else to put that and then that can free up that space so actually i think that's going to be a better idea because that means i won't have to get like i won't have to move this i will be able to just put this over here So we have a little Christmas meets fall moment going on here in the living room and I'm here for it. I am not gonna rush into decorating for Christmas this year. I feel like last year I kinda like wanted everything done in the same day and you just, it's too much for my brain this year, you know? So I'm gonna do it little by little. I'm so happy I got the Christmas tree up. I love the, um, what is it called? This It's not the skirt. Oh my God, what is it called? You guys, I don't remember what is this called. I can't think right now, <laughs> but I love that. I will insert the name right here, but it looks so good. It literally just matches perfectly with my vibes. I'm gonna turn off the light so you guys can see how cute. Oh my God, I love it. It's so beautiful. Over here, everything stayed the same. I definitely need to deep clean my couch. I feel like because this couch is light, it got dirty super fast and it definitely needs a wash. I stained it. I don't know what the heck I stained it with, but I need to get this deep clean like ASAP. But over here is what I did on this side, which I think looks kind of cute. I'm not sure yet. I'm not fully convinced. Y'all know me. I'm always like changing things. So right now this corner is okay. I do like the bookshelf there though. I think it looks good. I'm just not sure if I want the tree there. I just wanted to add some kind of festivity over on this side, but 
we will see, you know, what goes on. And then I put the little pompous situation over there so it doesn't look so bare. So, but I'm loving the tree. The tree is perfect here. We can still pass by. It's a little tight. I mean, the living room is not that big, but I think for the most part, I made it work. The tree is up. That's what counts. I really wanted to make sure that I knew what space it was gonna take and where I was gonna put it. So at least I know it's there. It looks really nice. And especially with the lights off, I just don't know where I'm gonna put this at. This is a dog's cage. It definitely cannot be in the living room. Again, I don't have a big living room and it's very, this is pretty big. Um, so I need to figure out a spot for it. But for the most part, everything looks so nice. And it's November 5th and my tree is up. I cannot believe it.